Good morning, this is Piper the Sailor Man coming to you from the island of Puerto Rico right here. I'm in my uh, living room in my, my wonderful comfortable chair. I'm with a uh, good old American corn cob. And I'm, I'm really excited. I'm really excited this morning. There was a blend. Back in around 1995, one of my customers used to come and he would buy a product. I'm not going to say, I'm not going to say yet. He used to buy a product from a company which is predominantly Burley. And, um, he would always come in and brag about how he take it, how he would take that that brand and mix it with one of our house blends and come up with his own uh, tobacco, his own tobacco brand. And he would go crazy if if that product didn't come in, he would go crazy. It's not. It's not a. It's, that was. It wasn't an aromatic blend, but it was an American tobacco that we brought in. He would go crazy because he couldn't make his blend. Somehow that that stayed with me. Well. I was thinking about it and thinking about it and thinking about it for about a week already, you know, because I bought that blend that he wanted and I began thinking, yeah, I remember this this gentleman used to come in and want to buy this blend and it's an old, old blend and it's still around and then he would use one of our uh, tobaccos. So I began thinking, okay. What was it that now? Now I was thinking this is years, this is over thirty years ago. What what could he have possibly put it with that blend? So I tried that blend on its own. It was nice, but it was it was lacking in flavor or lacking in a topping, the straight tobacco. And uh, I was like, well, what could he have added to that? So I began thinking, thinking, thinking of a house blend, because I used to blend a house blend. So basically I knew what, what blends existed that it could have possibly be used to enhance the flavor. And I'm thinking, thinking, was it Latakia? Was it Cavendish? Was it uh, <laughs> this blend? What was it Marabella? Was one of our top blends. Now those blends I don't have. So I decided, well, What's out in the market that would be equivalent to a lot of our house plants? And I found it. <laughs> I found it. I found it. And uh, so I began mixing the blend. So you can live your life staying healthy. Trying different proportions. And when I thought I had the right amount or proportion of the two blends, I began mixing them up, mixing them up, and trying to blend. And once I tried, I said, this is it. This is a tobacco. He called it the coffee blend. Tobacco. Specifically for smoking, uh, I mean for drinking Smoking, uh, a blend for smoking while drinking coffee. I said, what would be the perfect blend out there that can uh, enhance the flavor of the coffee? Or you could smoke it. And I think I found it. And this blend 
It might be a little costly, but I'm gonna I'm gonna get tons of uh, not tons, but uh, a couple of pounds of um of both these blends, and I'm gonna mix it, and I'm gonna come. I'm gonna start distributing it for free and give it out to people to test. This blend, I love it. It's a blend that a rookie or a well seasoned, a well seasoned um, tobacco pipe tobacco smoker smoke. It's just like right there in the middle, baby. It's right there. It's medium. It's, it has flavor. After smoking half a bowl, that flavor starts kicking in. And I am so happy. I'm so happy. I, ah! I just hope they don't go up. So I went, looked at, looked at what was in one blend, looked at what was in another blend. I said, ah. So I'm overjoyed in, in, in finding an old blend. Uh, and I want to thank that customer for leaving that impression. It was obvious. I said, what was that gentleman smoking that would get him so upset? And for years, it took, I'm talking about with 20 years, he was a good customer. He come in every, every week religiously. And so I just want to thank him for uh, giving me the idea to, to explore. And I think I came up with a, a perfect blend for coffee smoking. And uh, this is this is great. This is great. I'm so ecstatic. I am so ecstatic because now I can have my own blend and uh, smoke it with my coffee. So I just wanted to share that with you. This is Piper the Answer Man. Uh, Piper the Sailor Man. Sailor the Piper Man. Coming to you here with a new tobacco blend. What am I going to call it? The Piper Sailor Blend. <laughs> Have a good one.